oh, I wish I had access to YouTube back in the early 80s when I was racing motocross. That would have been so helpful. What do you mean by that? I believe that YouTube is the world's greatest learning platform. You can find anything and learn any skill you want there, including riding a dirt bike and service a dirt bike. Back in the 80s when I was riding, I was just a teenager and we were going on a training camp three to four days every spring. That was kind of it, what we were learn how we were learning how to ride. If we were lucky, we had a coach teaching us some evenings during the season, but it was kind of that. And then our fathers always told us that we have to give more throttle and we have to brake later, which is actually correct, but it's more how to do it as well. And when it came to maintenance, as I said, I was just a teenager. I didn't do very much. My father let me do the fun stuff like washing the bike and cleaning the air filters. The rest he took care of. So now when I started to ride, I didn't really know how to do. So I had to learn a lot and I took help from YouTube and I have learned tons of things, how to ride a dirt bike and how to service and maintenance a dirt bike. I want to share the channels that I've been using to learn. So if you are in my situation, you're a vet rider that want to improve your skills, or if you're new to dirt bikes and you want to learn how to properly ride, I'm going to share with you the YouTube channels that I am using, a few of them at least, because I'm uh, watching a lot of YouTube channels. So let's dive right into it. The first channel I would like to share with you is the Moto Academy. The Moto Academy is run by AJ Catanzaro, who's a professional supercross rider. But here you can learn all the basics about how to ride a dirt bike. And that means that you can learn the body position, how to stand and how to sit and how to jump and how to brake and all of that. It is a really, really great channel to learn the basics, which is the same. It doesn't matter if you're going to ride supercross, motocross, enduro, hard enduro, extreme enduro, or trail riding, or desert. The basics are the same. You just have to apply some specifics for your style of riding, but that you can go into a little bit later. Here, it's really, really great. And they have a lot of videos, 385 videos, and there's many, many, many things here you can learn. So that is super great. They also have their academy. It is actually a real academy where you can learn to ride. You can go there and train with them. You can also be a member where you can download their app and then you can upload your own videos and they will, uh, the coaches will evaluate how you're riding. I have not tried a membership yet, but I might probably do it in the future, but this is a really good channel to start the Moto Academy YouTube channel if you would like to learn or improve your skills on the dirt bike. So that is the first channel. The second channel is Ride with the Nights. This is a good channel if you're riding more off-road like trail riding or enduro. They focus a little bit more on how to ride off-road and enduro. They also have a website with a membership option where you can learn more in depth via their courses and so on. I have not tried this one either, but there is a possibility to do that. So here you can browse what they, how many videos. They have 195 videos and there's a lot of good content here, how you improve your skills or how you learn from the beginning if you are new to this. So this is the second channel. If you're more into hard enduro, then the third channel is for you. It's the IRC Tire USA Moto, and it's run by uh, Rich Larson, which is a professional hard enduro rider, and he's really, really good at the bike. He will teach you in a very, very good way how to ride hard enduro. The basics are the same as in the Moto Academy, but here he goes a lot more into depth with uh, how to ride hard enduro. There are 290 videos here, so there is everything you need to know if you want to improve your hard enduro skills. Rich is also reviewing tires and obviously since he's working for IRC tires, he's promoting their tires, but they are show he's showing what tires are really, really good for hard enduro and other kinds of riding. So this is a great channel to follow if you want to learn more about how to ride hard enduro and what tires might be good for hard enduro and other kind of riding. 
When you're writing dirt bikes, you need to do service and maintenance as well. So let's switch over to that. Rocky Mountain ATV and NC, that's a really great channel to follow. They are doing product reviews since they are a shop that are selling a lot of things, but they are also doing a lot of in-depth videos about how to do service and maintenance on your dirt bike. I have learned tons from Charles and the others that are showing how to do maintenance from this one so it's just to follow directly when you're doing your service and maintenance so this is a really great channel and they also have a website where you can buy a lot of parts especially if you're located in the us and north america it's easy for them to ship to you but they are shipping worldwide too but uh, this is a really good youtube channel to follow to get product updates and stuff like that and the tips and tricks for doing service and maintenance the fifth channel is Dirt Bike TV, and as you can see, they have 597 videos, and they, most of them are about how to service and maintenance your dirt bike. They have in-depth videos about everything you can imagine about how to do service of your bike so you can keep it in a good shape. And of course, that will save you money in the long run if you keep it in a good shape. So this is a really great channel. They are also doing some riding and stuff. So you can see that too. They are testing bikes and stuff like that. I'm watching this channel mainly for the service and maintenance tips and tricks you get here because it's a really, really good library of videos on how to do service and maintenance. The sixth channel is uh, Highland Cycles. As you can see, they have 1,700 videos. That is totally incredible. And uh, Morgan, the main character, he is showing you also everything you need to know about how to service and maintenance a dirt bag. As you can see here, there are tons of videos. So you will find anything you need to fix your motorbike. And they actually, if you're riding a Camax or a GPX or any of the other bikes that are about the same, He's doing a, a rebuild of the forks and the rear suspension of that one. So you can find that on the channel here. Easy go to channel if you want to learn more about how to service and maintenance your dirt bike. So the seventh channel is Billy Ball channel. That is a little bit more if you want to relax and enjoy and see what the pros are doing. He's uh, doing some kind of vlogging so you can uh, get a glimpse on his uh, life, how it is to be a world champion in Super Enduro. He's a four-time world champion in Super Enduro. He's doing extreme enduro and a lot of things. And his videos are quite funny because he's, he's quite a character. So that is a really nice channel to follow if you just want to have some entertainment and see how the pros are riding their dirt bikes. The A channel is Joshua Hill. Josh is a professional supercross rider and free rider. He is incredibly skilled on his dirt bike, especially when it comes to doing free riding. Josh is uh, giving you a lot of uh, behind the scenes videos about how it is to be a professional rider. He's filming inside the stadiums and so on before the race and during the race. And, many things like that so that is very very interesting to know and then he's riding his dirt bikes in a lot of strange places and jumping and doing tricks that is incredible fun to see so this is a nice channel for some fun the ninth channel is Carson Brown MX Carson is an incredibly skilled dirt bike rider and he's known for that you can put in on any bike, how old, big, small, whatever it is, and he will go incredibly fast. There are a lot of crazy fun videos to watch here, like some of the videos when he was racing Ken Roxon on, uh, this is a RM85, and I think this was the 250 or 125 or something like that, and he's doing a lot of fun stuff on uh, dirt bikes. So, this is some um, entertainment on uh, two wheels, so I recommend to follow Carson as well. Those were the channels that uh, I recommend you to check out, but I'm going to do a few more uh, honorable mentionings. And uh, if you are riding a Chinese dirt bike like uh, my Kamax or GPX or something, then it could be nice to take a look at Robo Media. Robo is riding uh, hard enduro in the UK and he's got a GPX TSE 250. It's the same bike as I have, but in the GPX brand. And he also got the 300 two strokes. So he's doing some in-depth reviews of them and technical uh, service and maintenance tips and tricks too. So that could be really good to check out. 
If you're looking for some budget-friendly dirt bikes, then the Dirt Bike Dave channel could be something to take a look at. Dave is from the US, I believe, and he's currently riding a GPX 300 two-stroke, and he's riding motocross. And before this bike, he had a Kayo, so he has a lot of experience about uh, budget-friendly bikes, and he has been doing some rebuilds of them and upgrades and stuff like that. So there's a lot of content, 2016 videos, about budget-friendly riding. So this is well worth taking a look at this one too. This was more or less the important channels to me. I will leave links to the channels in the description below and if you found this video helpful please give it a like and if you didn't already please consider to subscribe for more information. Thank you very much for watching and have a great day. Bye bye.